Missy got locked in the bathroom. The door handle fell off and I was stuck. And the worst part is nobody was around to help me out. So thankfully I did manage to figure a way to get free, but that was just a little kooky. everybody how y'all doing today so I've mentioned in the past that I actually draw my own comics and make a lot of my own art so recently I just completed this picture here this lovely mermaid picture I call the trendy mermaid and you guys challenged me to color it professionally so not just like take the pencils and like the coloring pencils and just whoosh, whoosh, whoosh but actually, you know, develop uh, a bunch of different copies of the picture and make something really unique. So, yeah, that's going to be interesting. That's a big challenge because that's something I've never done before, but we're going to give it a shot, see how it goes. So, right now, naturally, I'm actually kind of looking for any leftover blemishes, any extra lines that might need fixing or erasing and all that very precarious and kind of annoying because just when you think you've got them all there might be more hiding out somewhere oh no the camera's fuzzing out on me oh jeepers ah there we go so yeah that's more of a close-up but oh no this camera's fuzzing out on me this is not good okay so here's how stupid the printer is this is what it did compared to what was actually going in the printer Pretty stupid. Just great. So, I have figured a way past my dilemma. Basically, I pressed down on the page while it was in the printer, and though it didn't come up very clear, I went ahead and traced over the lines I could barely see. Now I'm going to ink this version so that I don't have to ink the original, and this way I will get exactly what I'm going for with printing out the next couple of copies. Woohoo! So far I've kind of had to put my uh, little art challenge on hiatus for about a day or two, but hopefully after I'm done skating uh, we'll get back to that and I can get to the next step in my challenge. For glaze the ice here did not do a really good job of it. Like this whole ice is full of ridges and stuff. Here. Watch my feet. You can see that they're not staying on the ground evenly. They're like going up and down. So I don't know who is in charge of this. It is really weird. Weird thing now. The Zamboni just kind of came out in the middle of a session and is actually glazing the ice. For some crazy reason, I don't know. It's weird. First they went back in and came out, went back in and came out. It's so weird. I have no idea. Apparently, the Zamboni was doing only a partial ice cut thing. I'm guessing to get rid of all the ruts in the ice, but that was very weird. I finally got my copies here and I realized I'm very stupid. The original here says trendy mermaid. Okay, mermaid. What do I have here? Trendy me made. Me made. Like really? Now that I have my me made copies, I can whip out the pencils. Go like I want and get to work on some colors. Now because me maids are always in the ocean they never get a lot of sun as far as I'm concerned so what I'm going to do is take these really light pencils this sand and this peach color here I'm gonna color them very lightly and uh, see what that looks like. The 
front, I kind of have to press a little harder in order to see it better, but... Well, now I have most of my me made colored. <clears throat> and what I'm gonna do here is I'm going to go ahead and borrow my sister's coloring pencil since she has the shade of brown I'm looking for for her hair. So let's see how this goes. Okie dokie, so here we have a fully colored me made. So some of the colors are planned, some of them are kind of out there in left field, like that, there, and that. So I'm probably going to change some of these things. Oh no, the camera's buzzing out again. Oh jeepers. Either way, um, definitely got to play with the colors more. It's a good thing I have copies. <sighs> At long last, here are all four of the mermaids, or shall we say, me maids, colored. And here is the final one. I wasn't crazy about this one because of the colors here with the tail. I wasn't crazy about this one because this said pretty much the same thing, and the first one was kind of a nightmare with some of those colors there. But the final product is kind of exactly what I was aiming for. And sure, I didn't use much in the way of shading or lighting or anything, but that's because I'm going to do that all on the professional level of things. This is just a sample. So yeah, when we are ready to get that done, it will be pretty good, I think. So far my, <laughs> I can't even speak. And the door finally got fixed. 